this is going to be one of the most important things that you'll do with Notability. And this is backing up your Notability files to Google Drive. So you will want to do this and you'll want to teach your students how to do this. So first, I need to open up my Google Drive and I need to create a folder where my Notability notes will get backed up. So I'm going to go ahead and tap the plus button in the upper right and choose new folder. And I'm going to name this Notability Backup. You can name it anything you want but this will help me so that I know exactly what's going into that folder. And then I'm going to hit create. So now that I've done that, I can make sure that my Notability notes have a place to go. So once the folder's created, you can see it's there in the bottom left. I'm good to go and I can go into Notability and set that back up. up. So here's my Notability. I will go into settings and the first thing I'll do is go to manage accounts. And I'm going to want to log in to Google Drive from Notability. So I'm going to connect these two. So now that I've signed in, it's going to ask me if Notability can have access to this stuff so that it can back up my folders. Obviously I need to accept and provide access. So I hit accept and then that's connected and you can see it says log out. Then I'm going to go over to auto backup and I'm going to go from backup off to backing up to Google Drive. So now it's going to automatically back up all of my files to Google Drive as PDFs. So I'm going to hit OK. And then I'm going to tap the gear icon so that I can choose a folder destination. So here it's going to access my Google Drive and it's going to show me all of my different folders. Here's the Notability Backup folder that I just made. And then I'm going to tap Backup to Notability Backup. So here it is, the destination folder is listed, and I can choose the file format. So by default, it's set as PDFs. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and change that to Note. And what changing it to Note will do is maintain all of the formatting that my note, native Notability files have. So it's going to maintain all my annotations as separate pieces. It's going to maintain all my notes that I've recorded if I have any audio recording. So Note is probably the best file format if I want to actually be able to bring those back into Notability really easily and edit them, edit any annotations. You can choose any file format that you want. I would suggest using Note. Once you have that completed, it will show you any folders that you have. So from welcome to unfiled notes, I've got all these folders with notes in them. I want to make sure that's all checked off. If there's something that you don't care if it gets backed up, you can uncheck it. But you have 30 gigs of space in Google Drive, so you should be fine. So make sure that you have your subjects backing up. Go back to settings and then hit close. And you will now be backing up automatically to Google Drive. So I'm going to just create a new note. I'm going to write something on it. I'm going to go back to my library and notice it is backing up in my lower left corner. So it's actually saving that file not only within my Notability app, but also to Google Drive. So it's really, really important that you turn that back up on. That way, if anything should happen to your app, like your app gets deleted accidentally, those files are still going to be accessible in Google Drive.